What's up tech freaks? Hope you're all doing well. Paul here. So in today's video I'm going to be showing you a glass screen protector for the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus. So as you can see uh, it's got the 9H protection on here. It does also say that it's got an oilophobic coating, it's shutterproof, um, it also protects your eyes, anti-fingerprints and it is an HD transparent type glass there as well. So what we'll do, just pull it out from here, put that to one side. So as you can see, it comes in a nice um, cover in here and then you've got some more pieces in here as well. And on the back of the actual main cover, you do have a set of instructions as well, but it's just pretty much clean it, dry it off, lay the glass down and then push outwards from the center and it should stick down. Alright, so hopefully this will go reasonably well because I'm actually doing it through the camera lens. Um, if you wanted to use them, you have got some guide strips here as well. And this is like a dust absorbing sticker that you can sort of dab around the phone. But once you get a good clean on it, you probably won't need to use that. So I'll leave that to one side for the time being. And in here is the actual screen protector itself. Uh, let's try and grab hold of it a little bit stuck in the packaging because I think this one does have some adhesive going around the edges so there we go right at last so here's the screen protector as you can see it has got the uh, black edging going around it uh, cutouts at the top there for all your sensors so hopefully this will be as I said quite straightforward so first off these are numbered so obviously we're going to use the number one first the wipes there so we just tear this one off as I say bear with me because I am doing this from behind the camera lens which isn't always the easiest way to do it so nice little folded thing here just got to undo this yeah I must say it's quite moist this one um, there we go so we give this a good wipe down I'm gonna get rid of any bits that are on the screen, the fingerprints, any dust, make sure you give the edges obviously a good wipe down as well. Just make sure I'm covering this completely, Oops, that way so don't get the glare of the overhead lights. Alright, I think hopefully that should do it, it's looking pretty decent. And just try and keep your, so your fingertips off of it as well. Right, so that's that one and then we'll go with the number two here it's another white this is a uh, screen cleaning paper so I will tear this one off oh yeah exactly the same but this one's just dry uh, zero moisture on this one so same again make sure you get your edges try not to get any extra fingerprints on the phone and I'm looking across it and then that's looking pretty good. Very, very, very clean. Okay, and then the next step it tells you to do um, on the back of here is to peel off the protective layer of the adhesive side. So obviously the adhesive side is gonna be the inside of this. I'm trying to just hold it by the edges. So there is, I don't know if you can pick that up, hopefully there, there's a tab. So there's a tab there. So I'm hoping this will peel off, which it does. Bingo. Oh, and I just dropped a bit of grit on the phone there. Uh, bear with me one second. I need to do that. I see it's gone. Okay, so basically all it says is just to line up line up the phone i don't know if you can pick that up if i hold it on an angle but there is sort of like a holes like a uh, speckles in the actual uh case it's itself okay so line this up as i said please bear with me because i am uh, doing this on camera I'm thinking go with the top first. Uh, is that right? It's really hard to see this. Um, I don't 
don't want to go for it just yet. <laughs> this is really awkward. Maybe I should have had the camera in uh, a different position. But I think, I think I've actually got it. Let's have a look at the bottom end. You know what? That looks pretty reasonable. Are we going to go for that? No. I uh, just realised the topmost sensor wasn't quite correct. Yeah, I think we're going to do that. Right. So then it says put pressure outwards from the centre. So hopefully. That's what I'm doing now. Putting the pressure out from the centre. Yep. Yeah. Push that down, pushing that down as well. Well, that was a little bit of an operation. Obviously, I think it'd be a lot easier if you uh, did it, obviously, off camera. Uh, how are we fixed? That's pretty decent, I must say. There is a... Maybe if I turn it on, does that make it? No, it doesn't help me any. Make my life any easier. Right, so I'm just making sure the edges are down. Let's have a look. Yep, so far so good. Doesn't stink. And uh, Is this going to work? Oh, well, yeah, that works pretty well. Um, I've just done the iris scan and that's worked pretty fine. I just want to see what it feels like. Yeah, it does feel a little bit grippy. But I guess, obviously, because that's new at the minute, um, everything seems to be working fine here. Um, no complaints. So, there you have it. And you can see pretty much, hopefully, that all these sensors line up. It's a bit hard to get that. But they do look pretty well lined up, I must say. There's a slight lip. Um, I don't know if that might cause me problem with any cases in the future. Um, but I'll give you an update if it does. I've got other screen protectors coming that are supposed to be um, case friendly as well. So there you go. There's a video there just showing you how to fit the screen protector for the Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus. If you've got any comments, please leave them for me down below. Give me the thumbs up and have a good day. Thank you. Bye-bye.